This is Eternal Treasures with Melissa Sainz. How do you respond to unpleasant circumstances? This week's devotion for reflection and prayer is entitled, The Secret to Contentment and is inspired by Philippians 4, 10 through 13. I rejoice greatly in the Lord that at last you renewed your concern for me. Indeed, you were concerned, but you had no opportunity to show it. I am not saying this because I am in need, for I have learned to be content, whatever the circumstances. I know what it is to be in need and what it is to have plenty. I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in want. I can do all this through Him who gives me strength. In these scriptures, the Apostle Paul addresses the church in Philippi as he is imprisoned. He explains that despite all the difficulties, he has learned the secret of contentment. Paul understood that it was his genuine faith that established his satisfaction, not his circumstances. Unlike Paul, many of us think that if things go right, we will be fulfilled. However, that is an unrealistic expectation. Contentment is imperative in our relationship with Christ. It involves an inward, quiet spirit that is submissive to God's will and is satisfied with what we have. In this life, we will inevitably face many difficult challenges. Therefore, it's vital to comprehend the secret Paul attained and achieve the correct perspective. His joy and fulfillment were not derived from external circumstances, but internal ones. He was on a mission to spread the gospel, and he was determined not to let anything or anyone thwart God's plan. As we seek God for his purpose, he will equip us, sustain us, and enable us to persevere through every situation. Our journey in life is not about us, but about pleasing Christ and accomplishing His will. When we empty ourselves daily and have an eternal perspective, we will grasp this revelation. We will have peace and be complete. Apart from Christ, we can do nothing, but through Him, we will have the strength to accomplish everything. How are you navigating through life? Are you attempting to accomplish things in your strength or relying on the Holy Spirit? How can you change your perspective to attain peace and satisfaction through your trials? Let us pray. Father God, thank you for your provisions and the Holy Spirit that empowers me to do what you require. I acknowledge that no matter what I go through, your plans are good. I ask that you give me a heart that is humble, obedient, and content in every situation. Please help me to always fix my eyes on you. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. If you have any suggestions or comments, please email me at thelady at carrythelightministries.com. This is Melissa Sines with Carry the Light Ministries, presenting you with Eternal Treasures.